and an otherwise same night at this year's Video Music Awards. Every performance seemed to be an opening act leading up to Beyoncé's end of the night extravaganza. The diva was the recipient of the Michael Jackson Video Vanguard Award, the same lifetime achievement prize that brought together asterisk and sync at last year's ceremony. Perhaps thinking the snippet of Destiny's Child at last year's Super Bowl was enough, Beyoncé had no supporting players on her stage nor did she need them. Playing nearly the entirety of her latest visual album, Beyoncé sang lesser-known singles like Haunted and Rocket before bringing the crowd to their awkward feet oh, Taylor Swift as she brought down the house with drunken love and poor audition. But if this and T her spot on choreography are runs that seem to enamor the Twitter sphere, but rather the small glimpses into her personal life. The camera consistently panned to her husband Jay-Z and two-year-old daughter Blue Ivy throughout the performance. Seemingly trying to quell persistent divorce rumors, Beyoncé's set was peppered with shots of Jay-Z on the projection screen, including the happy family frolicking on the beach as the clearly emotional singer Croon Blue an ode to her daughter. Her mogul hubby introduced her as the greatest living entertainer and she called him her beloved a far cry from tabloid tales of strife and separate rooms. Beyoncé took no prisoners as she seamlessly transitioned between soulful ballads and gyration heavy anthems that ordered fellow females to bow down. But the most poignant moment came from a part with no words. As Chimamanda Gozziadeke's speech, sampled in asterisk 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 flawless, played with lyrics plastered largely in the background, Queen Bay posed in front of one word that spoke volumes.